So let's go over the rules. Rule number one, you can only use Slinger and Clutch Claw in combat. This includes things like shooting the monster, and I am allowing the use of things like using the environment to your advantage with your slinger, whether that's shooting boulders overhead, shooting crystals overhead, or just simply triggering toads. Rule number two, you are allowed to use slinger burst and wall banging. Kinda like with the first rule, slinger bursts are allowed as long as you're not following it up with a weapon combo. And using the flinch shot to send monsters to walls is kinda in the same area as using your environment to your advantage. Rule number three, you must play solo, that's an obvious one. Rule number four, no glitches or mods, also obvious. And finally, to beat the challenge, you must beat the final boss of Iceborne. And this will be a two-part video, as this video would be too long if it was both Monster Hunter World and Iceborne in one video. So the goal here is to beat Xenogiva in the first video, and then in the second part, it will be Shara Ishvalda. And one last thing, only a small percentage of you are subscribed. So if you really like my content and haven't subscribed yet, I would recommend doing so. With that out of the way, enjoy the challenge. Uh, I feel like this is gonna be a Oops. good one. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> like. <laughs> so good. So good. <laughs> That's the first quest already done. <laughs> Some stones. Never said I couldn't block because that doesn't deal damage to them. If it did that damage, like for example, if you were using charge blade, for example, if that did damage, you know, with, say, your guard pointing, then that counts. Th thus, you have to restart the quest. <laughs> Let me show you an example of what I can do here. I can... Oh. <laughs> Four. Five. Okay, so... Uh, I, I would have wall banked him there, but he destroyed the wall when I, when I turned him around. But what I did do... Uh, instead, is I weakened his face by attacking it five times. So now I can do tenderizer damage. <laughs> wow, this is just with red pits, guys. I might get Slugger Secret in 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 G rank or no Master rank. If 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 I can stun this easily, <laughs> that would be really fun. Look at this. <laughs> it's already stunned. Oh, wow. <laughs> Piercing pods OP. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Slinger. <laughs> Shotgun, sword, and shield broken. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Weaken his head because I won't have to wall bang. So that I can get. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Gonna kick the toad to paralyze it. There's no rule against that. Oh, I didn't even. I didn't even go into the thing. There we go. Dude, this is insane. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I need to reload. <laughs> I'm gonna have to refill my slinger ammo. But now I can do that. Oh, speaking of slinger ammo, he dropped some. There we go. Easy. I have to attack the body. There we go. Oh, I'm out of ammo, I guess. But he dropped more. <laughs> He's already limping, see? He's already limping. Ah. Uh, I'm just gonna have to use Clutch Claw attacks for this. <laughs> wow. 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 <laughs> what a finish. You know what? We're gonna try using the hammer for this. Just for the first time, we're gonna switch back to Sword and Shield, obviously, but I wanna see if we can do the same tactic with the hammer. <laughs> Slinger pot around here. Slinger torch. Oh, that's gonna be kinda rough, because there's only five of these. 
Oh goodness. <laughs> okay, that yeah, that's not doing enough damage. I think I think wall bangs aren't gonna do enough here. Oh gosh, this is nowhere near as effective. But I I got it. Oh booyah! Uh, gotta roll. Gosh, turning with this is hard. No. Okay. I didn't attack. I didn't attack. Oh. Oh. Oh, I can mid-air slinger burst. I didn't know that. I didn't know that mid-air slinger burst was a thing. Here, let me try that again. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Didn't know you could do that with the hammer. There we go. <laughs> eh. Oh, no. Okay. The only... You see, the only other issue I have with this... Is that um, my stamina is a problem? Booyah! Haha! <laughs> oh, quest is complete. So the little attack I just did there doesn't count. Doing this after after the quest is fine. <laughs> Woo! One, two, three, four, five. Okay, weakened his hands. Oh, goodness. <laughs> I might have to turn uh, a target aim assist off for the slinger pod. Just so I can aim for the hands more properly. Oh, gosh. Yeah, this, this is rough. <laughs> what? What? Wait. What? Wait. Wait, hold up. Hold. What? What just... You can do that with Slinger Burst? Nani? We're gonna activate our little boy here. I gotta get out of the way. Oh, goodness. And uh, the barrel's not even coming in to take the damage for me. Oh, no, he is, he is, he is. Okay. Get that last 1,000 in. <laughs> Easy peasy as always. And there he goes. <laughs> GG easy. One. Two, three, four. I'm not even gonna wall bang. Fuck. I ran out of stamina. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Booyah. Broken. Now more damage. More damage. Oh, slinger thorns. Let's test those out. You guys ready for some stun locking? Bam. <laughs> But bam, stun lock. Woo! Booyah! <laughs> Wait, what's the arrows pointing up to? My dad makes bald look good? Nice. <laughs> Can I just knock him off of the wall here? Oh, get wrecked! That worked! <laughs> oh, get stunned, boy! Get stunned, boy. Piercing pod. I can go down the length. Oh, no! What? I did it! No! <laughs> Dang it. Oh, my gosh. Well, there's our first mistake. I accidentally did an attack off a ledge, and I didn't even press. Oh, my gosh. What? No, hit the tail. There we go. There we go. <laughs> There's a rock over here that I can drop on him. Oh. Booyah. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Slinger and clutch claw only. There we go. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. <laughs> okay. Uh. Booyah. <laughs> The stuns are real with this one. Saying that after some years of playing. Beating the game with LBG only should have should that should be a hard challenge. Oh no! Oh, just out of the corner of my eye, I was just paying attention to chat and I accidentally do an attack. No! <sighs> oh, get wrecked! Get wrecked. Because I'm mighty. <laughs> no, no, no. Whoa. 
Yes! Oh my gosh! Did you see that? Did you see that? Epic moment right there. Okay, I need I need red pit. There we go. <laughs> Finish him! Dun, 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 There we go! Woo! My health I was about to die there too. There we go. <laughs> okay. Finally. <laughs> Let's hurry back to the reef. Booyah. Okay. Uh There we go. There we go. Big damage. There we go. 2 Three, four, come on. Five, okay, he's weakened. Take two. Oh! I was trying to weaken the face, but I wasn't paying attention to my health there. <laughs> face is weakened. This should finish him at some point soon. There we go. There we go. All right, so up next is Legiana. Hold on, before I do anything, I need to get the defense charm from this lady. Okay, there we go, now I'm getting hit. See, he's exhausted already. You see, the fact that I'm exhausting these monsters is ridiculous. Slinger and Clutch Claw OP. Well, well Slinger anyway, Slinger first. Shotgun, Sword, and Shield. <laughs> hey. I'm challenging myself. I'm not making this easy. Well, that easier on myself, I guess. Booyah. See? No problem. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> what? He never hit a wall? Nani? You, you dumb gyros, you tackled me out of my opportunity. Alright, there we go. Finish him. Well, it looks like I'm going to be doing some post-commentary for this section because one of my mods decided to troll me while I was doing this. So basically, my hunt with Rathalos went just how you'd think it would with the Slinger and Clutch Claw. The same type of thing, uh, weaken the head five times, Slinger it with, you know, things like Scatter Nut, Red Pit, Stone if there's any and things like that. Uh, this quest actually wasn't that hard. And then the same thing with Diablos. Diablos was a little bit more tricky because I had to use Sonic Bombs to get him out of the ground, but he wasn't that bad in the end. And after that, we did uh, the Zora Magdros quest, which uh, the rulings were a bit weird with this one because I can only use Slinger and Clutch Claw, but at the same time, I had to beat Zora Magdros in order to get past, so... In this sense, I guess this challenge is not exactly possible with Slinger and Clutch Claw only because of the Zoro Magdaros final fight. But uh, that's where I had to bend the rules just a little bit just so we can get past this with the, uh, the whole artillery thing. This is the same kind of issue I ran into with the other video I did, the Lance Charge only challenge. I card above or in the end card. But yeah, hopefully I don't have to do another post commentary like this for the rest of the video. So uh, enjoy. You see, this is the part where I'm... Stuck. I couldn't even destroy all of the cores. It's like 30 damage per shot. I really don't think there's a way for me to beat him without it. So I guess in that sense, it's not possible to beat Monster Hunter with only Slinger and Clutch Claw. Just for the sake of continuing this challenge, I will have to bend the rules a bit here. <laughs> well, it looks like I'm doing another post-commentary bit here, so... <laughs> The hunt with Puke Puke was the exact same as the hunt with it for the first time, the only difference being that I hunted it without a hammer this time. Now before my hunt with the high rank Anjanath, I was trying to cheese Basil Goose so that I can get his armor early, but sadly, I just couldn't deal enough damage to beat it and it killed me a lot because I was in low rank armor still. So after giving up on trying to get Basil Goose's armor, I decided to hunt Anjanath after, and his hunt went exactly how you would expect 
like with the last one. And uh, it was just a matter of weakening his head, slingering his face with uh, scatter nuts and whatnot. And Pink Rathene was a little tricky because she kept tail swiping me a bunch and Legiana got in my way a good amount, which made it a little bit more annoying. And Pink Rathene was taking me a good bit to actually take down and capture even because it was taking long. And then after that, I tried to hunt Devil Joe because I really wanted to get his sword and shield to increase my clutch claws damage at the very least because the slingers damage is fixed so having a nice buff to my clutch claw would have been nice but even though devil joe wasn't that bad with slinger and clutch claw only the problem i was running into was towards the end or somewhere in the middle of the hunt I would always mess up because of ledges. For some reason, ledges would always just make me thrust up with my sword doing an attack, and that would cause me to fail the quest based on my own rule set. And this happened three attempts, with the fourth one being a fail due to fainting three times. So after going insane with that, I decided to just go ahead and just progress through the game and just fight Nergigante. And you'll see how that goes in a bit, so uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. And I hope I don't have to do another section where I go over post-commentary. <laughs> well, uh, I could not complete the Devil's Request again because I messed up again by accidentally attacking with a weapon. Well, I'm just gonna have to move on to- uh, move on. I- I- uh, I wanna get Devil Joe's Sword and Shield, but I just can't if I'm just gonna keep accidentally failing against it. I'm just gonna do Nergigante with what I have. I don't even care. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> wow! I'm doing 14 damage to the head with just stone alone. That's actually get. This might actually be easier than Joe. <laughs> oh, get wrecked. Okay. Gonna weaken him. I know he knocked me off and that almost killed me, but that was worth it to get the weaken. Oh my gosh, he does so much. Uh, you know what? Booyah. What? Why did I? Ugh. I didn't even mean to uh, attach to the wing. I wanted to attach to the head. Get a wall bang off. I'm actually gonna. <laughs> I did. Why ledge? Why? While going up a ledge, pressing R apparently makes your sword and shield thrust upward. Ugh. Ugh. I had him limping. Come on. He's getting close. He's getting close. Come on. Just need one more. Hit! Wait! Piercing pods! Hold up. Hold up. I need to get a wall bang off before using the... Okay. Where are the piercing pods? There they are. You're finished! Yes! Let's go! Oh. oh my gosh. Piercing pods are clutch. I can actually hit his head from down here. He's also poisoned, I just noticed. Oh! Uh, strap in, boys and girls. This is bound to be a long one. <laughs> if you guys remember that from the Thunderlord uh, Worst Weapon Challenge. Oh! Get stunned, boy! What is he doing? Did you see that, guys? 
Oh! Did you see that? <laughs> oh! Nitro Toad come in clutch! <laughs> Clutch! Woo! Yeah! Come here. Oh! That barely got him! I'm not inclined to disagree right now. That barely got him. There's no stone up here. Ah! I need breathing room. I'm just gonna jump down. Get wrecked. No. No! Oh my gosh. No, no, no. Ahead. Get wrecked. Come on, finish this. Yes! Woo! With one stone left in hand. There we go. Oh. I mean, at least I didn't faint completely. Unless he actually does it right here. Okay, never mind. Woo! It's easy to avoid that uh, Nova with the uh, Slinger and Clutch Claw only. There we go. Got first stun. You do <laughs> My first time having Blast Blight. Wow. Gotta make that sick snipe. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Booyah. Booyah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. I was so close. I, I, oh, victory was right there. Stone. I have to remember to drop the teeth on him, too. So, that's gonna help. Oh, the thing got in the way. That's fine. The thing got in the way. There we go. Nine damage? Does he... Wait. What's his weak spot? There we go. Got some stuns. Okay. Oh, I have to weaken the head again. Oh, goodness. I have one stone. I can use it on him with this uh, thing here. Got him. Okay. Uh, is there any more stone? Yes. Okay. Booyah. In... Oh, come on. Wake me up. Come on. Cat! Oh, okay. Oh! Uh, I thought I was in the clear, and then I wasn't in the clear. Missing hard. Oh, I actually got the head that time. And I need to re-weaken it. But I need to play it safe first. Yes! Man. That was harder 
than it needed to be. Now, before we go into this fight, here's my skills. I've got uh, Slinger Capacity Level 3, and that is from the charm. And I also have Fortify, which will help if we, if we sleep. There's some stone right here. Let's grab that. What? What? You didn't even give me a chance! Oh my gosh. That, that zoom in did not help me. That was cheating. I call hacks. I call hacks. There's a thing I can drop on him right here. Like that. There we go. I can do that. And it missed. Great. He turned around as I did that. Okay, I weakened the arm there. There we go. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I can reach his head. I actually, I thought his head was so high off the ground that I wouldn't be able to reach it with um, my sling slinger ammo. Oh! I did not think he would hit me there, but I was going to Superman off uh, away from it. But I guess not. Wait. When he faints... I'm pretty sure that's my only faint right now. Slinger Thorn, I'll just shoot at his head. For possible stun. Also, phase two. Okay. The fact that he's poisoned is actually clutch. Also, where's the other pod? Pod, 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 pod. I'm picking up a stone. I don't want the thorn pod on me. Eh. Okay. One. Two. Okay. Weakened. And I fainted. Great. I can shoot his head from here at a good distance, kind of. Yeah. Oh, get wrecked! Get wrecked! Can we actually do this? Stones are doing more damage to him than I thought. Get wrecked! Are we legitimately about to do this right now? I have to not get cocky though. Ooh! Ooh! There's some here. There's some here. Piercing pods. Wait, no, no, no. No, I'm going to save the bomb pods for later. Piercing pods must have right now. Booyah. One. Just one for now. Did he drop any more? It looks like he did. Yes. Piercing pods. Best case scenario again. Dude, the piercing pods are good. Two, three, two more. Slinger thorn, okay. Not the, not, it's, it's the worst case scenario, but not at the moment. However, I can take advantage of them still. What I can do is I can shoot his head. Oh goodness. Clutch onto it. Hit the head. See if that stuns him. No, it does not. Okay. Still some damage until he drops something. Because <laughs> I'm out of pods at the moment. Okay, this is the last time I'm doing the post-commentary part, I promise. But I just wanted to mention in this part right here where I'm just hacking away at the arm of Xenojiva and I only realized this afterwards, but I completely forgot that you can farcast her back at camp and get more stones. I could have saved so much time just by doing that. And the worst part is, I had a farcaster on me, so it was just like, man, I whiffed kinda. But hey, at least I beat the thing, so uh, I guess you'll see that part. Spoiler alert. But anyways, enjoy the rest of the video. We can head. Good. Yes! Yes! Not yet. Healing lots. My goodness. Oh, yes! He's, he's sunk on the ground. That's a lot. Another potty drop. That's just a I don't need materials, I need pods. I'm gonna have to use the dragon pod that's over here. Ugh. Oh, 
I'll just shoot the head. No, head, head. Oh, we did it! <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> the worst pod that, that that was our last resort actually helped us. The poison w was ultimately the thing that saved us in this run. Oh my gosh. Ugh, this is gonna have to be a two-part video. I can already tell.